We're getting a closer look at his motive and what investigators found inside his home. Authorities say this is the deadly sniper, Micah Xavier Johnson, a former military man who went hunting for police, specifically white officers. One officer down. There appears to have been one gunman with no known links to or inspiration from any international terrorist organization. Law enforcement sources tell ABC News Johnson was armed for his shooting spree with an assault rifle and two handguns. It has been a tale of cowardice by an assassin. Johnson served in the Army Reserve from 2009 until 2015, doing a tour in Afghanistan. According to police, his Facebook page reveals some of that rage against police. He liked a page which said, quote, kill everything blue that moved. Overnight, police searched Johnson's home in Mesquite, Texas. Police say they found bomb-making materials, ballistic vests, rifles, ammunition, and a personal journal of combat tactics. This was a well-planned, well-thought-out, evil tragedy. Neighbors in this quiet suburb of Dallas were stunned that the killer was living among them. This guy lived around the corner from me and was willing to take people's lives that he didn't even know. You know, it, it, it's scary. Micah Johnson's sister took to Facebook writing, quote, the news will say what they think, but those who knew him know this wasn't like him. President Obama is cutting his European trip short in order to visit Dallas in the wake of the deadly shooting. The president will also host an event next week to address racial disparities in America and the criminal justice system.